All right, so if you're checking your device manager and you're seeing this PCI encryption decryption controller or unknown device things, you're likely going to have to go to AMD's website, assuming you have an AMD motherboard. If you don't, if you have a different brand, you might want to check there. But uh, you click these lines here. Um, then we're going to go to resources and support, and downloads, and Radeon graphics and AMD chipset drivers. We'll go in there. Then we have this download Windows drivers, Windows 10, 11, and it should automatically download this. You can run this program. All right, and hopefully it will install what you need. So we're gonna install. I'm gonna let this run and we'll see. Okay, so it's gonna detect what motherboard and stuff, chipsets and video cards you have connected that are AMD. And let's see what it if it'll solve the issue on its own or if I'm gonna have to manually figure out what all these drivers are. But let's see. going checking your PC so far nothing yet okay Windows updates still going all right so here you go and then it says AD, uh, AMD Radeon graphics there's additional stuff full install uh, factory reset I guess not there um, and then you can allow them to click stuff I'm gonna say don't allow we'll click next AMD privacy view, okay, and we'll install that. Then you got all of these, AMD 12C driver, GPIO, all this, uh, I don't know what this promotory thing, uh, promonatory, promontory, <laughs> what? All right, anyways, let's just install them all and see. Hopefully it's not junk software, but okay, you can see it's gonna install whatever it needs. AMD chipset drivers are installing, and let's hope those three things disappear. Let's see if the Windows updates are finding anything. Okay, 78%. All right, anyways, we'll let this keep going. And let's hope this, okay, it's doing some drivers. You saw it like flashed. It's going up and down the device manager. That means it's doing new drivers, and you can see one of them disappeared. It's that AMD PSP 11.0 device. Another of the unknown devices disappeared. And another one of them disappeared. And I think we're good. It doesn't tell me what exactly was the correct driver, but it did install all of those. So we're going to let it keep downloading and installing the rest. And I think we should be good. Uh, the video driver is probably going to be the one that takes the longest. But, oh, something went wrong. What does it mean? Oh, because Windows updates in progress. So, I mean, it finished all these drivers. I'm going to run it again one more time after Windows updates finishes, but I guess we got to restart. Um, so let's do that, and then I'll be back. I'll see you guys once we start running it again. All right, the update's finished. Let's go to the device manager again. Okay, there's no more of those things complaining about drivers missing, but let's go ahead and run this again and see if it finds anything that we need to install. All right. It's gonna check again for hardware. Okay. I'm not sure why it said it failed, but okay, let's don't allow again. Next. Install. Let's see if it finds the other things again. Okay, and I guess it already did all the rest, so now it's just gonna download what it needs and then install and we should be good I guess the one it was having issues with was probably the graphics one I'm not sure because there are only those two drivers now I didn't care about anything else so we'll let it run it says it's going to take about seven minutes but the timer as you can see is going down much faster and I guess it depends how fast your internet is so uh oh spoke too soon it froze <laughs> what just happened Why is the timer going up now? Come on, why'd you stop? Keep going. There you go. All right, I don't know what it's doing. It's getting frozen, so we'll just let it get take some time. Um, here you can see now it's installing the display driver. Okay, it's already going relatively quick. So there you go, the device manager is refreshing because it's detecting new drivers. As you 
can see. Looks like it should be good. Let it finish. It's still updating more drivers. After this, we're going to run Windows updates a few more times just to make sure everything is done. As you can see. Now it's installing the adrenaline software. Okay, and it automatically opened that software components on its own. So I think we're just about done, and there you go. We can help improve them by sending anonymous information. No. And we'll launch the Adrenaline software, but I don't think we really need to do anything with that, so I think we're good. Let's actually open the Windows updates again and check if there's anything, but here's the Adrenaline software, and I'm just going to close this. The customer can set it up themselves later. All right, I'm going to throw this away and we should be good to go. It's gonna install, I'll run the last few updates and we should be good. That's it, thanks for watching. Hopefully this helped and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.